this is it here. I imagined you greeting me here, and she's going to walk with me now up to Britnola Post. Then she'll she might follow me a bit. Now, if you go up there, if you, there's a path up there, you can get up to um, higher hair nap or lower hair nap if you go straight up there. There is a path. I have done it all before. If you carry on down this comb, it just it's just another comb that you can get out onto the area of outstanding beauty further up. But here, I imagined you'd sat on this one of these banks here, saying, "Come on, Sheila, take care crossing the water. Don't fall in." They, they, those people just crossed it without any trouble. But just look at the green. This is spring. This is when it's so gorgeous. So these shoes, are te the ones I've got on today, my new ones, are having to be tested. They're doing very well. They don't hurt at all. But are they going to? Uh, how are they going to be in the water? Hey. Eh? Yeah, not too bad. You can see by here, the stream is sometimes much bigger, faster and wider. And you've been sat here waiting. And when, I, when I've come back from a walk, and I come back down through this way, heading for my van, she'll often leave me here and say, bye, see you again soon. I know it's a bit of a imagination I've got, but it's just a little thing. I first thought of it. When I, you know, when I came here and um, when she died, I just imagined her sat there, very strong actually in those early days. I miss her a lot. I've missed her for years. Turbulent years I had and um, I lost contact with my family really um, for a variety of reasons I'm not going to go into them now I can see people up there Those trees. Oh God, it's so gorgeous up here. Some people up here. Like I said, I'm taking my time walking this bit. I want to enjoy this bit. Very much so, I really do. There's two women. I don't know which way they're going. They might be coming this way. Why are they going ahead of me? I'm going to turn off now until I pass them. A few people passed me, a woman and a child. I've been taking lots of pictures of the gorgeous trees, of course. There's a big hill there. I've been up and down that in the past. Now, here's a fork. You go that way, you go up what we always called Holford Glen, but it's actually got a much more sinister name called Slaughter House Coombe. And I can understand, I saw a big deer, a stag dead up there once, all bloated on one of my walks um, and I think when the hunt is on they often drive them down these combs so it might have a reason another stream to cross folks in this beautiful area don't want to drop the camera in do we? Right, we'll tiptoe across again. There we are. 
once again that would have been much deeper in the winter when we had a lot of rain I've got a picture somewhere around here I keep on my computer of this area isn't it gorgeous look Makes you want to go to the Louvre then, all that water, doesn't it? It's just so gorgeous. I just, I can't, I'm always absolutely breathtaking when I come here. Always. And I've got my jumper on. I'm going to be taking it off in a minute. I can just start feeling the heat again. No breeze. And uh, once we leave this canopy of trees... There will be the odd shrub and little bush that we can stop by now and again but it's very exposed with the sun right in front of you after we've gone through. Now like I say this part of the walk this beautiful beautiful part of the walk <sighs> seems to go so quickly and um, before we know it, we're, we've left it again for another time. But it is so beautiful. I'm going to turn the codec off for a minute. Let it have a little rest. It's not got its charger plugged in at the moment. Um... No, it's not got its charger plugged in at the moment. I'm going to have another rest period it's just up here. Get out with another fresh bottle of water. You can hear the stream as I go. folks there's a horse and a foal I can see them I just hope those people don't come by and um, scare them some people over there so I might better get past us and a foal a new foal it probably I've noticed a, a mare up here in the past, further back down there, I think they come up this bit to give birth. I've got to pass it, but I have to reassure the mother that I'm, I'm okay. Well, I want, I need to get my hat on as well. In a minute. I just want to get to that shade and um, take my jumper off and everything. <sighs> See if I can get some photos. Let's <sighs> get in the shade a minute. Oh, bloody hell. <sighs> take, take everything off. You need to get your hat. It's a foal and it's mother. She'll know I'm here. I'm just leaving this on a minute while I get my take my jumper off. I'm just trying to hope that these people don't come that are noisy. There's some noisy people coming. I'll never find a zip on this thing. I want my hat, put that away. Put that in there. I've got my hat on. It's going to start getting really hot in a minute.
and I need to take a picture of the pole. Alright, it's just rolling at the moment. Stay there. I need to get some water out. You don't have to worry about the water right away. You can always have an orange. I've just got to pack this camera up a minute. I'll do a video. I've taken a long distance picture at the moment, but you can bet your life the camera will go off just as I pass them. I'm coughing to let her know I'm coming. Don't want her to bite me or anything, you see. Um, she'll be very protective of her fall. So I'm, um, I'm going to video this passing, but the little fall might be curious of me, you see. Um, I'll get the camera ready. It's a boy one. Hello. I'm videoing you. How are you doing? I'm very nice. Is that mummy? Hey, is that mummy? So I'm not going to hurt your puppy. Mama, I'm just going past. It's okay. Lovely fall you've got. He's going to be a beauty, isn't he? Hey. That's a good mama. It's all right, mama. I'm going. See? You've got to eat lots, get lots of milk, haven't you? Hey? <sighs> okay. Bye then. <sighs> Sorry, we've got enough of that. That was quite good, wasn't it? Picture of the foal with its mother. Let's turn that bit off now. <laughs> 